this conversation started probably in 2003 or four. And one of the strategic objectives that the system had identified at that time was making a significant impact on risk-adjusted mortality. In looking at the options for doing that, we opted to go with an intervention that we thought would provide the biggest impact on mortality risk for our most seriously ill patients, that is the patients in our ICUs. And in looking at various care models, we saw the promise of telemedicine and we saw the outcomes that other systems had achieved with similar programs and that was really the incentive for our beginning the EICU initiative. And it was quite revolutionary at the time. It was a very large investment, uh, a monetary investment, as well as a major change in how we delivered care. And in the beginning, the medical director at the time was Jay Cowan, who had a significant influence on how that started. He put in a lot of hours at the beginning, along with many of our physicians who and our nursing staff who have done great things throughout the years um, in um, developing um, relationships with the hospitals and working with our critical care teams at the bedside to um, leverage, again, this technology to help patients um, throughout our systems at multiple locations. And it has proven you know, to, to, to have been a great strategy uh, for us to improve patient outcomes. We interface with our ministries in many different ways. Um, EICU and the ICU and the care delivery model is we're very much part of the continuum of care. It's amazing that Provena Health has instituted an EICU. Um, the technology is um, advancing us every day. Um, it allows us to be able to intervene on patients um, that have very subtle changes. We have been fortunate to save hundreds of lives uh, since the inception and really set up a, a program um, uh, where you know, the EICU coupled with um, the teams at the ministries, the ICU teams at the ministries to implement best practices, uh, be able to give feedback uh, back to our system critical care committee and local critical care committees, and most importantly, really redesign and make the care safer. It's about collaboration. It's about caring for the patient together. They were very, very, very uh, prompt in communicating with you, saying, hey, Dr. Bobad, what do you think about doing this on your patient? And that's, I think, it's very, very helpful to any physician. We have alerts coming up every few seconds for every patient which we are monitoring. And uh, we can correlate with the bedside monitor to see whether that's right. Uh, and in case needed, we can go into the room to see if the patient is really not feeling well and we can intervene as needed. Happy, Happy birthday, EICU. ICU. Happy birthday, EICU. Happy birthday, EICU. EICU, happy fifth birthday. Happy birthday, EICU. Happy, happy birthday, EICU. The EICU staff is a very well-trained, well-respected uh, staff. Our critical care nurses have at least five years of experience. Most of them have 10 plus up to 25 years of experience. Um, so very seasoned, very competent, very high quality critical care nurses. We have support staff of data assistants that help us with the technology of transporting some of the information. Um, certainly the IS team, we could not do this without the IS team. And being able to build the interfaces so that our database is rich in quality and we're able to get information very quickly. Happy birthday, EICU! Happy birthday, EICU. Happy birthday, EICU. Happy fifth birthday, EICU. Happy birthday, EICU. Happy birthday, congratulations, EICU. One of the things that we anticipated certainly was an impact on mortality and length of stay in the intensive care units, and we saw that fairly shortly after we began the EICU program. One of the things that I think we didn't necessarily anticipate, but that we certainly saw, was that this gave us as well as the hands-on extra set of eyes that we anticipated, it gave us a vehicle for disseminating leading clinical practices. And through the structure of the Critical Care Quality Committee, we've had a way of disseminating that across the units and achieving an impact that we really didn't anticipate, but it's proven to be very significant. 
for instance, we talk about our sepsis initiative. We're also talking about Wake Up and Breathe, which is, which is an initiative to improve um, and reduce ventilator days for our patients in the ICUs. But really bringing a lot of these expertise from around the system, and instead of having um, sort of silos of expertise, bringing them all together and trying to provide directive from, from a system standpoint of how to deliver critical care, how to improve quality, and how to improve outcomes. I think that's been um, one of the benefits. Congratulations EICU, happy fifth birthday. Happy birthday EICU. Happy fifth birthday EICU. Happy fifth birthday EICU. Happy birthday EICU. Happy birthday EICU. Congratulations EICU on your fifth birthday. Happy birthday EICU, thanks for all you do. Happy fifth birthday EICU. Happy 5th birthday, EICU! The most important piece of our job is to be able to work alongside the bedside nurses. And that communication with the nurses and physicians is what truly improves the care of our patients throughout our system. At this day and age, to get a second opinion or to have an input from a board-certified physician in that specialty, it's, you know, you don't, you don't get that 2 or 3 in the morning. You know, and they're there, they're behind the camera, they know exactly what's going on. So I think it's a valuable asset to have. You know, somebody who, who has knowledge of patient care in the critical care unit, I think that's a big plus. We're really excited about the future of the EICU and the new redesign we're implementing across the system, which is the partnership of the EICU with on-site intensivists at each of our local ministries. We believe this model will help us to further improve patient clinical outcomes and improve the patient care experience. Happy birthday, EICU! Hey, EICU, happy fifth anniversary. Congratulations! Congratulations and happy fifth birthday, EICU! Happy birthday, EICU! Happy fifth anniversary, EICU! Happy fifth birthday, EICU! Happy fifth birthday, EICU.